Alright, hey, today is St. Patrick's Day, and I decided to show you this story with me. This, the following is 100% true. It actually did happen. Alright, so this was back in 2005 or 2006, and my mom and I decided to go to Biddigan's. Because we usually did that every year on St. Patrick's Day. So, this one time we happened to be there, well, everybody had got St. Patrick's Day started early, because when we got there... Everybody was drunk. So, it didn't really seem out of the ordinary when later on, like, when appetizers showed up, there was this guy in the corner who was a bit, well, face down in his food, sort of. So, I, I was like, went to my mom and I was like, do you think he's alive or do you think he's dead? And she goes like, oh, no, 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 he's probably just sleeping, probably passed out. Well... Praying, Ungus, that's the guy, wasn't alright. He wasn't just sleeping. He had died. So, this guy was face down in his fish and chips. So, I mean, that didn't really go well. So, then, you know, the lady was trying to, like, put her hand around the guy to make sure, like, oh, you know, he's just passed out. He's fine. But in reality, he was dead. So... A bunch of um, people at the restaurant acted like they were Angus's mates and buds, and they kept ordering more rounds and more rounds and more rounds. And like, oh, to Angus, and like, yeah, why isn't Angus drinking? Oh, he's drunk. Oh, all right. So more rounds and more rounds and more rounds, which just went around the whole entire place. And then to make matters worse, there was these ladies who I think were in their 40s or their 50s they were wearing green feathered boas and they had obviously been drinking as well because they started flirting with Angus well you know obviously the, the his girlfriend or wife I don't remember which one it was didn't quite like that because well you're flirting with he was they were flirting with her his, her man and well even though he was dead, you know, I mean, you don't want someone flirting with your man, even if he is, you know, dead. I mean, you still have, like, he's mine, not yours. So that didn't really bode well, and, but, as, but, by the time, you know, we were getting ready to leave, everybody was kind of all, you know, just celebrating to Angus, to Angus, to Angus, and the fact that there's a dead guy in his uh, fish and chips. All of this is 100% truth. No lie, no bullshit, no nothing. Happy St. Patrick's Day! Are you still currently still standing?